Hello, welcome to Crafty Kitty. My name is Erin. That's right. I've filmed three videos in a row because how else am I going to spend my New Year's Eve but with you guys? And I also promised in a previous video I would explain to you what this little notebook is about. So I sent Brian, well, and he was already on his way to Walmart or someplace like that. And I asked him to pick me up a notebook so I could write down some notes. This is what he came back with. A furry googly-eyed teddy bear. So, what is in this weird notebook, you might be asking? Well, it's my 2023 resolutions. Most of which you don't really need to know much about. Except, of course, I have some thoughts on what I want to do on the YouTube channel going forward in 2023 and I wanted to share them with you. So what better time than New Year's Eve to do this, although you will not see this on New Year's Eve. I believe this will be coming out on the 2nd if I've scheduled things properly. I believe so. <laughs> so first of all, I would like to continue this year with the Crafting Kitty Creator Spotlight. I'm having fun with that. I think you all are having fun with that. At least I hope you are. I keep getting entries and positive feedback. So let's keep that going. Um, so, yeah, so here I have on my goals list that I need to complete my 2022 temperature blanket. I made it to July 14th. <laughs> but yes, that is a goal. It will get finished in 2023. So the other thing I am going to be doing the Sophie's Universe crochet along. So I would love to hear about anybody else who's doing it, see your progress, feel free to you know, send me pictures, put them in Facebook, whatever you wanna do, but I will be talking about the Sophie's Universe this year. I'm going to, a major focus of 2023 is going to be stash control and de-stashing. So, I'm going to use Sophie's Universe as a de-stash event. I'm not planning out a like a pre-planned color palette or anything like that. I'm going to just grab and see how things move me and we're going to go from there. <laughs> so it's an adventure. Who knows? Um, so to that um, end... I will be participating to the best of my ability with Bridget from Queen Crafts by Bridget. She's doing a D-Stash 2023. She's asking you to keep track of the weight of yarn you use from your stash or the yardage. I think it was weight or yardage. I just remember weight in my head. <laughs> so that's what I'm going to try to track. Um, so yeah, and then she's asking creators to do videos announcing or you get your information to her in some way she has a hashtag all that information is on her channel so i'm not going to rehash it right now but i will have her channel linked down below if it sounds of interest to you so also to that end i'm going to be saving my yarn labels and throughout the year we're gonna we're gonna have fun and i i plan to have like a giveaway at the end of the year. You know, I think they're kind of fun. Guess how many labels are in the bin? Let's do it. I do have a lot of mystery and unbanded things in my stash. And in that case, I'm just going to take a square of paper and write down, you know, mystery. I think it's this. Used it in this and throw it in. So that's why I'm planning on tracking my weight because I just, I don't know the yardage of some of these, but I can throw it on the yield kitchen scale and figure out how much it weighed. Um, and the other thing, I do plan to continue some of the things we've been doing. So you'll be seeing more yarn reviews. I do have a number of tutorial ideas I'd like to come out with. And so I, I would hope to do that. We have plans to get me a new camera set up, which will hopefully make those things look better. Um, but we'll see. I mean, it's going to be an experiment setting that up. I don't know when that would be live. And, um, of course there will be more poor decisions. You, you can't stop us from making bad decisions. Poor decisions. <laughs> 
So of course, Brian will be back and in the videos as well. We have fun. I hope you guys have fun. I think you have fun. Um, but yeah, well, please let me know if there's anything else that would be of interest that you'd like to see. Um, I did do a couple of things last year that I let slide that I'm hoping to bring back. Like I have one video that's my favorite things. And I talked about my favorite red heart yarns. Well, I just, I never got back to that idea, but it's one that I like. And especially as I'm de-stashing and going through my stash, I think I can pull things like that together more easily. And I also did like a stash splash video where I just showed, you know, I was trying to organize parts of my stash. I have one video. Maybe why not film that if I'm doing it again? So things like that. I'm also... On a personal level, I would like to increase the amount of book reading because I am an avid reader and I've gotten away from that. So I'm thinking about maybe at the end of my weekly roundup, just talking about what book I'm reading, what audiobook I'm listening to, stuff like that, um, to just share a bit more like that. And it keeps me a little more... I'm going to say accountable, but it's not really the word because it's not like you guys are going to come punish me if I don't read my book. But, you know, I can track my progress and that will be helpful for me and maybe enjoyable for you. Who knows? But, you know, it'll be just a minute or two at the end of the video and you are more than free to click off videos at any time. I'm not holding you here or anything you don't want to listen to. Hopefully. <laughs> um, but yeah, so please, those are... oh. And Colleen and I are moving forward with our Between Friends collaboration. We've talked about what we plan on January and February. So if any other creators want to get in on that and join us, we are totally open and welcome. We had a couple people nibble and say they might be interested, but I, I never heard back from anyone. So if you would like to know and would like to participate, we'd love to have you. Just contact either of us and we'd... We can figure it out because let's let's spread the love. We're going to shorten it to just between friends and you're all our friends. Let's get more fun going between us. Okay, I'm going to write that down on my list and I will talk to you later.